We've just taken a closer look at the Teuschental track here in Germany. Now let's check out a German team, the KTM Saarholz racing team. It started 40 years ago, a world championship team that all grew and grew and 10 years ago switched the brands from uh, Honda to KTM. It's cool to have all, only German riders because the communication is easier and we are a German team, we want to, to bring the German riders further. It definitely helps that I am in a German team. Uh, the communication is a bit better. I got a German teammate, so um, yeah, we get along well in the team. Everyone kind of enjoys being at the races, which is very important. I know my team made quite a long time. We know us from the German championships. And we belong pretty good together. Before I raced the MX2 championship, I was racing the ADAC MX Master Series and won the ADAC Youngster Cup. And also I rode the European championship in 250. It's quite a big step because the riders are all pretty fast, and, but it's a good experience for me and I learned from it. My first season on the 450 last year, uh, moving up to a mixed GP as well. So it was a big step. Last season I raced four GPs um, just to get into the MX GP circus, you could say. It was a really good experience for me and uh, I got the chance this year to do all European rounds. Uh, it's really raised my level a lot. For me this weekend, the home GP is just positive. I don't really feel pressure in the sense of having to perform in a certain result. The main goal is just to learn, to learn a lot with the, the riders and the tracks and of course to catch some points. Um, for me the main priority this season is to just keep progressing the whole season, try to improve every weekend, get points. The goal for next year would be to be able to do all the GPs. I think we have a good setup this year. The riders are good, prepared and I think we help them to learn more and uh, get some points. At the end of the season, I think we want to, to bring them to top 15, both riders.